sorry, I am getting a little sick, so if I sound really hoarse, that's why. and welcome back to my channel for all things mommy, wife, and life. My name is Chessa. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a review and my first impressions on the Arbonne RE9 skincare line. I did a video on my review on the Arbonne 30 Day Detox line and my friend who actually sells Arbonne reached out to me and asked if I would like to do a review on the skincare line. And I said, sure, why not? I wanted to do a review on this line to see number one, what my honest opinions are and number two is if it's worth the money. I thought this would be a great video to do so you can get an honest opinion of somebody who doesn't actually sell the product. Also, now would be a great time to subscribe if you haven't already. Quick disclaimer, I do not actually sell these products myself, nor am I affiliated with Arbonne in any way, so my opinion will be 100% honest. I will say that my friend did let me try out these products just for a trial period for a couple of weeks just to see if I would like them and for the purpose of this video. But other than that, no affiliation. I will leave my friend's information below if you're interested in these products or if you have any questions or concerns. You can definitely reach out to her. So if you've never heard of Arbonne, this is a multi-level marketing company and it's kind of similar to Mary Kay. They actually have um, makeup products, skincare products, um, health products, as you may have seen in a previous video. It's similar to that company type of Mary Kay as you can have parties and then in turn be um, a seller if you would like to be. Now hear me out, I know what you're thinking. Oh, this is like a pyramid scheme. And it kind of is to a certain extent, but in a good way, if that makes any sense. I know from watching my friend that you can actually make a good living off of this business and it is legit, but enough about the business, let's get into the skincare product review. These are the products that I tried out. This is the RE9 skincare line and it's supposed to help with anti-aging and wrinkles. This is the RE9 skincare line and it's supposed to help reduce the appearance of crow's feet, skin smoothness and firmness and improve skin elasticity. This line has six different products and each product does its own little thing. This skincare set retails for $327. But you can also purchase these individually if you didn't want to have a whole set. Now I'm going to take you through each product and let you know my opinion. So here is the first thing in the set. This is the RE9 Advanced Smoothing Facial Cleanser. And let me, I'm just going to read off of this little thing, this sheet that she actually gave me. So that way I can kind of give you guys an overview of each product, what it's supposed to do, and I'll let you know if it actually lives up to the hype. This smoothing facial cleanser, this creates a light foam to gently wash away makeup and impurities while delivering plant-derived moisture. And I will say that I was really pleasantly surprised with this cleanser. I like that it actually did what it said it did, as in it took away all of the makeup and impurities and it still delivered moisture. So I felt like my skin was really soft after using this and it still got all of my makeup off, minus my waterproof mascara. It didn't get all of my waterproof mascara. I actually tried getting in there really well to see if it would get it off because I really wanted to get a great opinion to see if it would work. And it didn't get all of my waterproof mascara off. So I will say that, but it did get everything else off. But it's kind of like any cleanser. It's not gonna fully get all of your waterproof mascara off. You actually need to use a different makeup remover for that. So, I mean, it's standard to see what any other cleanser would do, but I do feel like it really did leave my skin feeling moisturized. And I will say that it did sting my eyes just a little bit, but not like, you know, super intense burning, but it did sting my eyes just a little bit. So, step two is this regenerating toner. It says a quick mist of this antioxidant-rich pH balance toner helps minimize the appearance of pore size and enhance radiance by evening out the appearance of skin tone. What I do like about this product is that it is a spray. So you don't have to waste product by transferring it onto a cotton pad and then onto your face because you lose a lot of products that way. So I do like that you can just kind of mist this all over your face. And then I like to go in and just rub it around just making sure that the product is evenly distributed. As for the pore minimization, I didn't really see an overall pore minimizing effect just because I don't really have large pores to minimize anyway. So I didn't really get a huge sense of that. So maybe because I don't have large pores, I'm not the best candidate. It didn't make my skin feel any worse, any better. I just felt like it was a great addition. So here is number three. This is the Intensive Renewal Serum. This super concentrated formula helps reduce the appearance of fine lines with advanced peptides, antioxidants, and essential botanicals that work synergistically to hold in moisture and help enhance the look of skin smoothness and firmness. First off, I will say that I didn't really enjoy the scent of this that much. Um, it almost has like a weird spice scent to it, but almost medicinal. So I wasn't a huge 
huge fan of the scent on this one, but it did kind of grow on me as I kept using the product. Nothing overpowering, but mm, not my favorite. Also when using this product, I will say that my skin did get a little bit red and irritated with this, um, mostly because I think it is a super concentrated formula and I will actually read to you what it, the thing says. It says, the most potent product is the Intensive Renewal Serum and it's highly concentrated vitamin C. This is an exfoliator and is the product that will give your skin a healthy glow. Vitamin C needs to build up on your skin, so start slowly and start with half a pump and work your way up. And if you are sensitive or experience unusual redness, cut back on the amount and gradually work your way up as your skin gets used to it. So I didn't do that. I just kind of went for it because in full disclosure, I didn't read this thing that she gave me um, until afterwards. <laughs> Start off slow and then work your way up. I should have done that. And that's, I think, why my skin got a little bit irritated. What the hell is that? But I think this is what ultimately does the skin renewal. So if you're going to splurge on any of the products, maybe it should be this one just because this one obviously is like the active ingredient, it sounds like. It does make my skin feel smooth and everything, but I did actually feel um, experience some like skin flakiness, but it says that is also to be expected since this is like an exfoliant. But I will say that this serum did make my skin feel very soft and smooth and hydrated. The next one is the eye cream. This is the corrective eye cream. This reduces the look of fine lines and deep wrinkles and dark circles. I didn't really have any dark circles to kind of begin with, so I can't fully say if my dark circles are any better. As far as fine lines and deep wrinkles, I honestly can't say, I mean, I'm, I've only been using this line for like two weeks now, but I can't fully say that I experience any help um, underneath the eye. I do still feel like my um, my makeup is still creeping into there. Super up close, you can I can definitely see that I do have still the same amount of wrinkles underneath my eyes. So I don't think it did anything quite yet, but again, I've only been using it for two weeks. But I did like it that it didn't feel super greasy and it did feel like my under eyes were very moisturized. So I liked that. So you're actually supposed to use all of these four products twice a day in the morning and also at night before you go to sleep. And then the next step, you're going to switch up depending on whether it's night or day. So this is the day cream that you're supposed to use. Box in moisture and help restore skin youthful appearance. It has an SPF of 20, which I really do like. I like not having to worry about sun exposure and the sun exposure is the number one ager. So I like that this has sunscreen in it because I don't have to repeat that step again later. I think this is actually a really great product. Um, I really like the smell of it. It's very citrusy, it just smells really good. It absorbs really fast, which I like because I can do my makeup pretty closely after I apply this and it doesn't feel like my makeup is sliding around, so I do really like that. And then at night, you're supposed to switch out the, the moisturizers and then use this moisturizer. So this is... <laughs> This nighttime repair cream is an ultra hydrating blend of botanicals and collagen supporting ingredients to replenish moisture and deliver essential nourishment to maximize the skin's natural reparative cycle. Helps reduce the look of fine lines and deep wrinkles through moisturization. No, but honestly, I really did like the formula of this um, scent wise. It doesn't really smell like anything, but it doesn't smell good. So, I mean, it's just like kind of a wash with the scent. It did absorb into my skin really well, but I also felt like it was still on in the morning. So when I did get up in the morning to wash my face, it still felt like my skin was very hydrated and like I felt like I was like washing off this product in the morning. So I felt like it was still on there and it lasted throughout the night, which I actually really like. So all in all, my overview is that I really do like these products. I will say that this product, this line did deliver on the moisturizing aspect of it. It definitely left my skin feeling very moisturized and hydrated. It didn't make my my skin feel ultra greasy. It does feel smoother. Whether or not it helps with my anti-aging or fine lines and wrinkles, only time will really tell on that as with any anti-aging line. I will say that these products did make me break out slightly. I noticed that like some more blackheads were kind of coming to the surface and I did notice a few little breakouts here and there. I spoke with my friend who actually um, let me use this line and she said that that's completely normal. Your skin will experience some detoxing and I, the breakouts did go away. I know you're not supposed to do this, but I did like extract to my blackheads so and I did notice that like my skin felt fine afterwards like if you don't actually have a skincare routine established I think this line would be great for you because it has everything you need in one kit I like that you don't have to like go pick out certain other different products from like kind of shop arounds like it's all all here in one place so that's really nice you can kind of just go through it and it's a great line it, it would just make everything be a no-brainer which is great but if you have certain products that you know and love then maybe the whole line wouldn't be the best for you maybe you can just pick certain products out which might be more cost effective honestly if you do really want to try these products out but you don't want to throw down $300 on a skincare line I feel you on that I have a hard time doing that too 
if that were the case and you still wanted to try the products but you don't want to throw down all that money on the whole line and then I would definitely start with the cleanser just because I think it act, it definitely does what it says it's gonna do it takes off your makeup and it removes impurities while still moisturizing I'm sure these products are meant to be used together but if that's the way you're but if you're worried about your budget I think that's a great way to start off and I think let me check retail $44 for a facial cleanser uh, I oh. I just, it's such a great cleanser, but I wouldn't personally be able to spend $45 on the cleanser. That's just me. I will say that these products would last a long time. So if you kind of break it down per use per day, it might end up actually being worth it. I don't, I can't actually say how long it lasts, but I know that they do last a long time. I also think that these products could give a higher end product from Sephora or Ulta a run for their money as well. So if you do normally buy your, your facial products there, then I mean, maybe this would be a great option for you as well. Overall, I like the products. They made my skin feel great. And if you're used to buying the higher end skincare products anyway, this would be a great line for you. However, I do think that this company is a bit overpriced. I do really like everything that this company stands for and I do really like the products, but I also feel like you can get something similar somewhere else for cheaper. That is my honest opinion, and I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and don't forget to subscribe. Let me know if you like seeing videos like this. I love trying new things out for you guys, but your feedback is always helpful and appreciated, so definitely leave me a comment down below letting me know. Also, can we just take a moment to the fact that I have 500 subscribers now? Like. I'm so excited. Thank you guys so much. If you've made it to the end of this video, leave me an emoji in the comments section. I'm going to enter you into a secret giveaway that I'm going to have just for making it to the end of this video and for my 500 subscriber giveaway. So I'm gonna leave this little giveaway open until February 22nd. And if you leave a comment with your emoji down below and make sure that you're subscribed to me here and then also on my Instagram, if you guys do that, then I will enter you in to win a $20 gift card to Starbucks. I know it's nothing major, but that's just my little quick way of giving back for making it to the end of this video. So I really appreciate you guys. And I just want to say thank you so much for getting me to 500 subscribers. And then when I get to 1000 subscribers, I will be doing a bigger giveaway. So definitely help me get there so I can do that for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm so very grateful for each and every one of you and stay tuned next week for a new video. Love you guys. Bye.